black back too, which I'm just gonna tie the side here because I want to be more cropped. Oh my god, okay, so I've just spent 500 pounds on ASOS. <laughs> Why do I do that? Because I'm addicted. I've got an addiction to shopping. Hi guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Oh my god. It has been so, so long since I've last another YouTube. I went a little bit MIA because I had injuries, but now I'm injury free and I'm ready to get cracking on with the vids. So I thought I would bring it back with a haul and it is actually an ASOS haul. We've not got just the one parcel, but, oh my God, we've got a big boy on our hands. We've got this one. Basically, we got a shitload of clothes that I'm gonna try on. There's no actual kind of stylist what I'm going with, so it's not like dressy. It's literally a mixture of all of my favorite items that are on ASOS at the moment. So I thought I'll do a haul for you. Let's crack him open. The top that I'm wearing right now, by the way, is actually from ASOS, as you can tell. I'm a big fan of ASOS over here. Ah! <laughs> so many goods! Okay, let me try them on. This is outfit number one, which is basically a misguided, oversized, like, shirt, like, jumper dress. It's actually really cute, and I've literally just styled it and will be styling all my outfits with Doc Martens, Jay did, and I've just got a little black backpack with it. It's literally, like, one of the nicest outfits ever, and I feel like you can dress it down, you can dress it up. I would probably wear it like day to day, and especially now that spring's on the rise, as long as we're not in lockdown for it, let's pray that we're not. But, love it. It's got like four different colors on it. It's so soft, like I'm obsessed. So, I'm gonna give this dress a, hmm, seven out of 10. Let's go on to the second outfit. So this is outfit number two, which I'm just gonna tie the side here because I want it to be more cropped so that it's a little bit more figure hugging because this skirt is super, super figure hugging. Um, it go, does goes down to your ankle. It's got like a little split skirt here, again, styled with my Doc Martens. So this is the Nike swoosh oversized t-shirt in like a light beige color this is the asos design like lounge travel ribbed skirt i think it would make like such a nice day spring type outfit so just style it with this and these boots just look so nice and you can even like wear this t-shirt with jeans or whatever but i just think you know now spring's on the horizon um i may as well just get dressed up to you know spend spring in my kitchen so i'm gonna give this outfit a 8 out of 10 because this skirt is just so soft and comfortable like genuinely I love it so let's try outfit number 3 so this is outfit number 3 which is basically like a boohoo ribbed one shoulder crop top styled with like relaxed dad jeans um, from ASOS and they're like tall rise and I am actually 5 foot 8 and these are tall on me like i don't know if you can even see the bottom of them but i've even got like heels on my docks and they're pretty long but they're really nice and baggy at the end which i actually love um these are in a size 10 which is probably slightly bigger than my size because they'd sold out of all of the eight feels so comfy relaxed i love the rip i like it's i've just styled it with my own um leopard print belt um this top is really nice as well and i'm just gonna see how it is styled with this orange jacket which i have which i think it look really nice with it so let's put it all together bam, bam, bam. get him out the bag so let me just check what the actual name of this one is because i can't fully remember so this is the asos design soft cotton utility jacket in buttermilk and i think it actually looks so nice styled with this outfit like, it's like a denim type material. I probably would roll up the sleeves, like, slightly, but I won't be doing that right now. But the whole outfit is so, so nice, and I would definitely recommend buying it. This is so soft. It's only, like, six quid. Bargain hunter! I think it's so nice. Love it! Love it! Love it! Whew. So I'm going to give the jeans, like, actually a nine out of ten, because they're so nice, even though they're a little bit baggy on me well a bit long on me shall we 
basic. And I feel like you could even wear this with like a night out outfit, this jacket. Um, yeah. Oh my gosh, it looks like I've got a tail. Jeez, it's wet. What's this? What's this? What's this little bump? Oh my god. Well, wow, that is strange. I don't know how I feel about um, this ribbon. It's a thumbs down. I don't like it, don't know. I've, you can actually take this out. I think I probably would take it out because I just like more of a loose fitted jacket rather than something that's very tight fitted and belted. When I've already got a belt here, I don't want to do blade belt it. I'll just singly belt it today. So let's go on to the next outfit. So now we have the next outfit. So basically I'm just wearing the same jeans again, which I actually realized have a bloody bum slit, like a genuine bum slit right there. Don't know how I feel about that. Well, I'm bloody showing off my knee here. Bloody flirting. So I basically just styled it with this like ASOS Halton X studded uh, top. And it is actually part of a cohort, but I think it just looks like literally how nice is that top? Mm, shimmy shimmy. I love it. And style with these jeans just kind of like dress it down a little bit, but it's still kind of like night up vibes. I am wearing it with my dogs. However, I think it would look really nice with some like boot heels, even like a nude heel, I think would look really, really nice with this outfit. So yes, I'm gonna say this outfit bangs from me. So I'm gonna give it like a, mm, like a, like a, like a eight, like an eight out of 10, because I do like this top a lot. Let's check out the next outfit. This is the next outfit, which is like the misguided boyfriend blazer in blue styled with the misguided uh, matching trousers for this cohort. I am wearing it with like a boohoo mesh detail t-shirt. Right, so this is outfit number five, which is the misguided boyfriend blazer in blue styled with the matching cohort trousers um, in blue as well. They've got like a little um, pinstripe type detail going down the front of the leg, which I actually really like. These are in a 10 and they are slightly too big for me. So I would probably suggest getting a size smaller maybe because they are quite stretchy surprisingly. I didn't think that they were gonna be, but they are. This blazer jacket, just makes me look like a little bit of a frump. That's how I'm gonna describe it. Maybe if I just whip off the jacket, I think maybe I prefer the outfit, I don't know. I have to see it in full. Again, styled, of course, with the beautiful Doc Martens right here. Um, so, I mean, I do like these trousers. Like, I am a definitely a fan, and they've got like a nice fastening um, structure here. So yeah, I'm gonna give this t-shirt, which is quite classy, you could wear it with jeans, you could style it in many different ways. So I'm probably gonna give this t-shirt like a six, because I don't love it. These trousers are gonna be getting a seven from me. The blazer jacket, this little bad boy. Hmm. What are we giving? It is too oversized, I think, for my liking. Like, I don't like how long the jacket is. I wouldn't mind it being maybe like an inch shorter, would be nicer. So I'm gonna give the jacket like a five. Let's go on to outfit number six. And we've got outfit number six, which is basically like the little cardigan that I was wearing earlier, just with styled with these ASOS O-branded jeans, which I love. Like I like blue color you could wear them in the day or the night or you could style them with another top like so so this is like a little uh collusion cardigan i actually prefer it i think with this cardigan with these jeans because i think the white makes the blue of the jeans really stand out a lot more and i might even style it with a little leopard print I think just to mix up the colors i think would look really nice styled with this little bit of pattern in the middle because they're both quite like block basic colours. We've got white, we've got blue, and I think this then really just mixes up the colours to just give it a bit of a break, really. I think it looks really nice, styled with this belt. And this cardigan is like so soft and comfy, and it's like one of those basic items that I would just recommend that you always have in your cupboard at all times. So I think this is like outfit number six. 
seven just so you can see i love it so here then we've got outfit number eight which is the asos design hourglass skinny fit trousers which are literally so nice and they've got such a soft feel to them they're like a khaki color i would uh, describe them as and i've just styled it with the collusion um mini cardigan so i really like this as an outfit day or night then of course i am partial to my prints don't say it don't say it don't say it don't say it. it's carol baskin <laughs> so i feel like you can style it with the side bag like that or just down like this and i've styled it with these doc martins i've also linked every single item down below so you can literally directly find each item online this is super super cute so you could style it with this bag if you wanted or you could style it with this bag just like the cute little black backpack it's so nice I'm a big fan, so I'm gonna give these trousers a nine out of 10 because they just make your figure look great. And the cardigan style of it, it's just nice. It's a nice daytime outfit to wear once their solution is over. So let's go into outfit number nine. So this is outfit number nine. These are the Nana relaxed uh, trousers in pink and they are actually part of the cohort but I just thought I would style it with that boohoo top one shoulder that is only six quid. Why is it not already in your order was basically the question I'm asking. But styled with my lovely jaded Doc Martens and this little black bag just gives it really cute day outfit vibes. Not gonna lie, the actual seam bit here is a little bit itchy and you know how I feel about itchy materials. I don't enjoy them, basically. But the whole outfit is nice and it's got like, um, like a sparkly detail that hopefully you can see there all the way down the leg and they're like velvety feel. So I'm gonna give these trousers a seven out of 10 and the whole outfit an eight because I just love this top so much. Basically, I'm obsessed. So just buy it. Basically buy everything in the collection. <laughs> if I could keep it all, I would. So now I've got these like ASOS design cargo trousers, which I've actually tucked into my Doc Martens because they had a bit of like a weird cut at the end where they kind of flared out and I just didn't like it. It just was not me whatsoever. But this, these trousers are really comfy. They're kind of like a loungewear, perfect for isolation. as we're all stuck in and we all need our loungewear. I like that it's got like a tightening strap around here. Um, yeah. It's really nice actually. I do like these trousers. So I'm gonna give these trousers a seven out of 10. This is outfit number 11, which is the North Face cropped jumper. And I've literally just styled it with a soft um, like midi skirt and it's like cut out the back. Like I think it's quite cute this skirt, but you could also style it with those lovely ripped jeans that I had on earlier that I think could definitely give it more of like a spring vibe. But what I do like about it is the colour of this, like orangey, lovely spring colours. Get them out for spring vibe. Even styled with this lovely little backpack. I'm a fan, so I'm gonna give this outfit a eight out of ten for this jumper. And a 7 out of 10 for this because I would have liked to have the split been more around the side rather than at the back. But what can you do? Outfit number 12. You could also design the jumper with these ASOS design like legging shorts I think. Obviously wearing my dogs again. But as a whole outfit it's quite nice for summer, spring type vibes. I am a fan. Let's go on to the last outfit of the haul which is kind of like a ravery type style it's got like sequins on it here sequins here it's got a ring detail here and a ring detail here i absolutely love it it ties down at the back there sorry about the tag i do actually like this the only issue is that i feel like i definitely could have got this top in a bigger size probably but i do like it so i'm going to be giving this final outfit which is obviously different to the other outfits that I've been wearing in the haul. So I've decided I'm gonna give this outfit a eight out of 10. Cause I do like it as a cohort a lot. You could wear this to like an event or you could just wear it on a general night out, but may as well just wear it when we leave isolation because ain't nobody seen you in time. So just 
show map what they're missing baby oh god stop i hope that you've all enjoyed the haul i've gone through like loads of different styles from like streetwear to more like classy i've gone to a suit i've gone to a bloody rave outfit whatever it is but it's basically just like a spring haul from asos so i hope you've all enjoyed and i've also linked every single item down below and thank you all so much for watching just remember to give it a little like and a subscribe i greatly appreciate it and i will see you all very soon i promise to keep going with this youtube because i'm in isolation now i've got nothing else to do so it'll keep me motivated keep me on top of it and keep me recording thank you all so much for watching